Imagine standing atop the world, looking down from an elevation so great that even skyscrapers appear minuscule. This is the experience offered by the Burj Khalifa, the world's tallest structure. This spectacular edifice, with a staggering height of over 800 meters and a mind-boggling 160 floors, is more than a testament to human ingenuity. It stands as a symbol of Dubai's relentless ambition and unprecedented forward drive. The Burj Khalifa isn't just a building, it's a statement. In the heart of Dubai, a vision was born, a vision to create the world's tallest building. This vision was not merely an aspiration to reach unprecedented heights, but an ambition to create a symbol of human ingenuity and architectural brilliance. The Burj Khalifa was conceived not just as a building, but as a beacon of Dubai's growth and prosperity. The inspiration for this architectural marvel came from a source as humble as it is beautiful, the Hymenocallus flower. This indigenous desert flower with its harmonious structure and elegant form became the blueprint for the Burj Khalifa's unique design. Its long, slender petals that extend outwards from a central core influence the building's three-lobed footprint, a design that marries aesthetics with functionality. But the influences didn't stop at the natural world. The architects also drew heavily from the rich traditions of Islamic architecture. The spiraling patterns, the intricate geometric designs, the beautiful arches, all played a role in shaping the Burj Khalifa. The tower's tapering shape pays homage to the onion domes that adorn Islamic monuments, while its Y-shaped plan was inspired by the arches of Islamic architecture, designed to maximize views of the Arabian Gulf. As the design started to take shape, it was clear that this was not just a building, it was a statement, a statement of ambition, of progress, of the audacious spirit of Dubai. It was to be an icon that would reflect the city's rapid ascent from a modest trading port to a global metropolis. And so, the vision was set, a vision of a skyscraper that would push the boundaries of what was architecturally possible, that would stand as a testament to human creativity and determination. This vision was not just about constructing a building, it was about crafting a symbol, a symbol of Dubai's unstoppable rise, a symbol of a city that dares to dream big. Behind every great structure there's a great vision, and the Burj Khalifa was no exception. The seed of an idea, inspired by a humble desert flower and the rich traditions of Islamic architecture had taken root. Now it was time for this vision to become a reality. But how do you build the world's tallest structure? You push the boundaries of what's possible. The Burj Khalifa is a marvel of modern engineering, a testament to what can be achieved when human ingenuity meets unwavering determination. The journey from the drawing board to the Dubai skyline was not without its fair share of unique architectural and engineering challenges. One of the most significant hurdles was dealing with the formidable desert winds, which can reach up to 50 miles per hour. A structure as tall as the Burj Khalifa needs to be flexible enough to sway with the wind, but sturdy enough to remain upright. The solution was a design that borrowed from nature and tradition, the buttressed core. The Burj Khalifa's design features a central core, flanked by three wings that act as buttresses, providing additional stability. This design not only ensures the building's structural integrity, but it also maximizes the amount of usable floor space. But it wasn't just the wind that the engineers had to contend with. The desert heat presented another challenge. The solution? High-performance concrete. This isn't your everyday concrete. It's a special mix that can withstand the intense heat of the Dubai sun and the immense pressure of a building that stands over half a mile high. The use of this concrete was a game changer. It allowed the builders to pour the concrete at night when temperatures were cooler and then cool it further with chilled water. This prevented the concrete from cracking and ensured it could bear the weight of the colossal structure. The Burj Khalifa is a masterpiece of engineering, a building that defied the odds and redefined what was possible. It's not just a tower, it's a symbol of progress, a beacon of human achievement. In the world of architecture and engineering, the Burj Khalifa stands as a testament to human innovation. It's a reminder that with enough creativity, determination, and technological advancement, we can indeed reach for the sky. Or in the case of the Burj Khalifa, even beyond. In the world of architecture and engineering, the Burj Khalifa stands as a testament to human innovation. The journey from blueprint to reality was a monumental task, one that involved an international workforce. Imagine a blank canvas, a stretch of desert sand, and a vision so bold it would forever change the skyline of Dubai. This is where our story begins. The construction process of the Burj Khalifa, the world's tallest building, was no ordinary undertaking. 
It was an expedition into the unknown, a dance with the limits of engineering and architecture, a testament to human ingenuity. The timeline of construction is a testament to meticulous planning and unyielding determination. The first stone was laid in January 2004. Over the next five years, the construction site became a buzzing hive of activity, with workers from countries far and wide laboring day and night. The first key milestone was reached in the summer of 2006, when the Burj Khalifa surpassed the 50-story mark. This was quickly followed by another landmark achievement in 2007, as the tower eclipsed the height of the previous record holder, the Taipei 101. But the journey was not without its challenges. The desert heat, high winds, and the sheer scale of the project tested the resolve of the workforce. Yet they persevered, united by a common goal, to bring a vision to life, to build not just a building, but a monument to human capability. The international collaboration was a significant aspect of the project. Engineers, architects, and construction workers from over 30 countries contributed their expertise and skills. This collective effort was a beautiful symphony of cultures and knowledge, merging to create a masterpiece that would stand tall against the test of time. The final height of the Burj Khalifa, a staggering 828 meters, was only revealed upon its completion in 2010. This moment was a triumphant culmination of years of hard work, collaboration, and innovative thinking. The construction of the Burj Khalifa was a journey of perseverance, collaboration, and sheer will. It stands today, not just as a testament to the vision of its creators, but as a beacon of human potential and the remarkable things we can achieve when we dare to dream big. The Burj Khalifa isn't just an architectural marvel, it's a multifunctional hub. It's more than just a towering figure that stands out in the Dubai skyline. It's a buzzing ecosystem that houses a variety of functions and services, all under one roof, or should we say, one sky. Nestled within this colossal structure are luxury residences, high-tech offices, and the world-renowned Armani Hotel. Imagine living in the clouds, literally. The residences offer an unparalleled view of the city, making it a unique living experience. Then there are the offices where work is combined with an inspiring view that stretches as far as the eye can see. And let's not forget the Armani Hotel, a statement of luxury and elegance that offers a stay like no other. But the Burj Khalifa isn't just about opulence and luxury, it is also a model of sustainability and efficient building maintenance. The building's design incorporates a variety of energy-saving features to reduce its carbon footprint. For example, the exterior of the building is designed to reduce heat gain during the day, lowering the need for air conditioning. Moreover, a significant amount of the water used in the building is recycled, reducing water consumption. The building's maintenance is also a marvel in and of itself. Specialized teams work round the clock to keep the Burj Khalifa in pristine condition, from its highest point to its base. The Burj Khalifa is not just a building, it's a symbol of a new way of living, where luxury, sustainability and efficiency coexist. It's a testament to human ingenuity and the possibilities that arise when we push the boundaries of what's possible. So the next time you look at the Burj Khalifa, remember, it's not just a building. It's a city within a city, a testament to Dubai's vision of a sustainable and luxurious future. The Burj Khalifa is more than just the world's tallest building, it's a symbol of Dubai's economic growth and cultural significance. This tower, this marvel of human ingenuity, has undeniably altered the fabric of Dubai and the United Arab Emirates as a whole. The Burj Khalifa is a testament to Dubai's transformative journey, from a quiet fishing village to a vibrant metropolis recognized worldwide. It has become a symbol of the city's meteoric rise, embodying the ambition that has driven Dubai's growth. Its silhouette, now synonymous with the Dubai skyline, is a daily reminder of the city's unwavering pursuit of progress. But it's not just an economic symbol. The Burj Khalifa has also left an indelible mark on the cultural landscape. It has become a canvas for artists and filmmakers, featuring in numerous films and television shows, reinforcing Dubai's position in popular culture. The annual New Year's Eve fireworks, radiating from the Burj Khalifa, is a spectacle that millions around the world anticipate. It's a celebration that transcends borders, echoing Dubai's cosmopolitan spirit. Moreover, the Burj Khalifa has become a magnet for tourism, attracting visitors from all corners of the globe. Its observation decks offer an unparalleled view of the city, a sight that leaves many in awe of Dubai's architectural prowess. It's a must-visit destination for anyone stepping foot in the city, 
serving as a gateway to the rich history and culture of the region. But perhaps most importantly, the Burj Khalifa has inspired a new generation of visionaries. It stands as a monument to the power of dreams, proving that no vision is too grand, no ambition too lofty. It's a story of human potential, urging us all to reach for the skies. In essence, the Burj Khalifa is far more than a towering structure. It's a symbol of a city that dared to dream, that dared to reach for the stars and achieved the impossible. It's a testament to the spirit of Dubai, a city that continues to innovate, to evolve, to grow. The Burj Khalifa is not just a building, but a beacon of progress symbolizing Dubai's rise on the global stage. The Burj Khalifa is a testament to human ambition and the limitless possibilities of architectural and engineering prowess. This iconic structure, towering above all, challenges our perceptions of what's possible. It's not just a building, it's a marvel that embodies the audacious spirit of human ingenuity. It's an epitome of the extraordinary feats we can accomplish when we dare to dream, plan and build beyond our perceived boundaries. The Burj Khalifa stands as a reminder that the only limit to human achievement is the sky itself, and even that may not be a limit at all.